Well, hello once again everyone. It's your boy Jingles Roscoe again with another speed drawing. Today I decided to draw one of my most favoritest Star Wars characters of all time, Darth Revan. Here we go. Alright, so first of all, I'd just like to say that this video is coming out a little bit later than I wanted it to. It's about a week later than I wanted. Actually, it's like a little bit more than a week. Because I, originally, I wanted to have this video done and uploaded for uh, May the 4th be with you. Um, but that didn't happen. <laughs> like, whoa, work is, uh, work's been really busy. And, um, and it's my day job. And uh, so <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta put forth the work at work so that I have time to put forth the work for my hobby job, which is this. Um, and so I wasn't able to finish the picture itself um, until a, about a week afterwards. Uh, when was it? It was like, yeah, it, it was about like the f about Sunday, I think, uh, afterwards. No, no, it was definitely the Monday because that's when I usually upload videos and I couldn't get it done. Uh, but this is a uh, character that I really wanted to draw a lot uh, for a while. Also, this first pose I didn't go with. Uh, I liked the first pose. I thought it was looking really good, but um, I wanted a more subdued pose. You know, a more imposing pose. And uh, actually, I looked up some of the old covers for uh, the Battlefield games. And uh, uh, that, that soldier that's just slowly walking towards the camera was like, yeah, that looks cool. And so um, I did that. Also, uh, this face right here that I'm doing, it won't be showing up in the final image. But I wanted to do it um, as a special treat to whoever happens to watch the video instead of just like looking at my deviant art or like on on reddit where i post it so this is just for you guys just for you that are watching this video um so when this finished picture is all done and he's all looking cool and imposing just remember he's actually got that face on that's his that's the face he's wearing and so <laughs> anyway um yeah darth revan um Boy, I've, I've been playing a lot of uh, Knights of the Old Republic again. Uh, I picked it up again because um, the super best friends were playing it, and I was watching them do it. And uh, they were—I don't want—I want, I don't want to say that they were—they were doing it bad, but um, they were kind of doing it bad. So uh, I picked it up again and uh, started playing it. Um, just kind of uh, during the same time they were. And um, I almost finished it. I got pretty far. They're done with it now. Um, so I've <laughs> they they beat it before I did. So that's cool, I guess. But uh, now nah, it's just, you know, life and work. Like, real work, my day job, plus this work, my, my online job. Um, I just, I haven't been having much time to play video games. I mentioned this before, but... Uh, I don't have a whole lot of extra free time and uh, so I, I try to take my free time where I can uh, and if I can't then uh, I just I don't get any free time uh, so like uh, drawing is kind of considered free time uh, for me at the moment since uh, I'm not getting any money for for doing this, this is just something that I I really want to do is just draw all the time and so I figured, hey, why not record my drawing and kind of give some some tips and tricks uh, here and there <laughs> for whoever whoever happens to be watching and whoever uh, likes watching me just draw stuff. And so, um, yeah, I just, so I don't have a whole lot of time to play video games anymore, which which hurts a little bit, but at the same time, I feel like. Um, drawing has been uh, kind of a hobby that's been worth it lately. Also there's this hand here that was kind of giving me some troubles and so I actually put my own hand up to the screen and posed it. Um, I have a post for it uh, that I can link you to. 
of me holding my hand up to my computer screen and after having drawn the hand itself and you can see like that's just my hand posed that way <laughs> um but yeah uh that's i've lately uh i've been getting messages from more than one source um asking me about doing commissions which i've never really done before and doing um other art related stuff and so i'm getting more and more offers here which i never had before so it's kind of a new thing for me to have people like asking me hey could you would you be interested in, in doing this or uh you know uh maybe we we could uh do you have some contact information so i can get a hold of you and i'm like uh not really there's not not a whole lot of people that have ever asked me before so <laughs> um they they asked oh can i have your your facebook and i'm like you see my facebook is a personal facebook um and i use it specifically for like keeping in touch with family and like old friends and stuff so i don't really give that out to people which if you do that's totally fine um but i didn't really have anything substantial else to like offer as like something that people could use also this lightsaber that i'm drawing it, it the hilt itself doesn't really turn out too well and uh in a minute you'll see kind of this this change that i make to it um and i'll explain it more in a second but um yeah so it's been it's been crazy to have people like take notice of me in a business way <laughs> Because I'm still, I consider myself still a hobbyist. Um, I'm not a professional uh, in the strictest terms. And so it's just like, it's weird when somebody is offering me like business, uh, <laughs> which is something that I've wanted to do and do stuff and, and turn this into a business someday. It's just, weird when it's actually starting to happen <laughs> so uh for anyone who's interested in watching i now actually have a public twitter account uh which is linked in the description if you want to check that out so now you can uh follow me for you know I'll, I'll post every so often talking about art and when i upload videos and stuff also here i actually um found a picture of the actual lightsaber model from the game itself and uh, just kind of took it and traced over it, which um, I'm not a huge proponent on tracing, but um, that that lightsaber was giving me too many problems trying to make it look accurate. It didn't actually look too bad at first, but now the new lightsaber I think looks a lot better. Anyway, so yes, now I have a Twitter account. Uh, so feel free to follow me on that if you want to. Um, I have a couple posts on there already. And um, I'll just probably be posting. What I'm thinking is that I'm going to be posting like sketches and um, other other things that I usually because I, I warm up. I draw some stuff when I warm up before I do like these speed drawing videos. And there is still stuff every now and then that I I like to just draw that isn't actually a part of the speed drawing process. You know, it's its own separate thing that I just, I want to just sketch sometimes. And I don't really share it either on here or on my DeviantArt um, because they're just rough sketches or whatever. But I might do that for um, for my Twitter if you're interested. Um, go ahead and just uh, send me a message on there. That's where I'll be doing, I think, most of my quote unquote business, I guess. It'll just be, you know, it's the, it's the official Jingles Roscoe Twitter. <laughs> Which is so weird for me to say, but I feel like it's the next step that I guess I should be taking, um, which is really cool. It's just really kind of strange for me, <laughs> but I'm sure I'll get over it. Anyway, Revan. Revan is a character that I, um, when I played uh, Knights of the Old Republic and Knights of the Old Republic 2, um, like, he's a character that I was just like, wow, 
this guy's really cool. And then like the, I guess, um, canon way of like how things worked in uh, in Knights of the Old Republic. I'm like, man, he's like, doesn't really care like the opinions of the Jedi or the Sith. He's just kind of like, he does his own thing. And um, he's just like a gray Jedi, but not even like a gray Jedi. And you know, I think that's cool. And he's a cool character and he's incredibly powerful. Um, and he's got like a really cool design. First of all, all this detail that I put into this drawing, holy heck, you guys. This is like one of the most detailed pictures I've ever drawn, but I'm super happy with the way it turned out. I'm actually just in general really happy about how this Revan just turned out in general. And um, it was a, a lot of fun to do. It did take a long time for me to do. I was, I was surprised on how long I felt it took for it to come out. Also, I've noticed that there's a, a few different, like, official iterations of how his outfit looks. And um, so I kind of blended a bunch of different things together to kind of make my own. It's kind of weird, but um, like, this is also I have the first time that I really put in some um, real visual effects and stuff. But um, after I, I've, I'm done here, as you can see, oh, I also kind of put in sort of a background, which I never do. Uh, I really put on a lot of effort into this, into this drawing that I wasn't planning on. But I think the ending results of it, it really like ended up a lot better than I expected it would. <laughs> and I, I didn't even really put in real shading or color the lines this time because I was tired by the time I was done with this uh, drawing, <laughs> but, uh, there he is. There's the, the finished, uh, slow zoom for you. Um, I'm really happy with the way that this turned out, but, um, I'm going to be taking, uh, maybe a couple weeks break from making videos for a little bit. Cause as I said, I've gotten some offers from some other outside sources that, um, I'm going to be doing some work for them for a little bit. Hopefully it won't take too long. And um, even if it does, they said that it, they, they're not in that much of a hurry to have it done. So I'm sure I could probably fit in another video sometime. But I don't think I'm going to have another video next week. But the week after, I'm going to try and push one out for you guys. No, that sounded weird. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, thanks a bunch for watching. Uh, if you want to see the high-res uh, image of this. It'll be on my DeviantArt account. Um, as well as if you have any questions or anything, you can either leave it in the comics, comments or leave it at my Twitter. It's there. I'm at Jingles Roscoe. <laughs> Thanks a bunch for watching. I really, really appreciate it every time. And I hope you guys have a good one.